Positioning in Overwatch 2 is a very simple yet complicated thing to understand in Overwatch. Many players, new or veteran, seem to have trouble determining whether or not they're in a good spot or they're in a bad position. But today, I'm going to make it simple for you guys and show you three rules that I used in order to have godlike positioning. If you guys find this video useful or helpful, please feel free to like, sub, and share because it helps me help you out. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. So before we get into any of the rules, I want you guys to ask two questions to yourself. Can you do your job effectively in the space you're in? And can you do your job safely? For example, in terms of can you do your job effectively? A very simple example is Reaper versus Soldier type positioning. Obviously, as Soldier, you don't want to be in their face but as naked trying to barrel stuff your gun because your gun does not do that much damage up close compared to a Reaper shotgun. Same thing with Reaper. You don't really want to be sniped people with your shotguns from the high ground this also leads into safety because soldier in the front lines is not as much of a threat compared to reaper and a reaper might be a bit too safe to not even do his job effectively and meeting these two conditions are probably some of the most important and simple things to determine whether you have good positioning and with that we're going to go into the three rules that can also help elevate those questions and the first one is going to be using natural cover you're always thinking about natural cover. Using natural cover helps you save a lot of resources rather than using it. For example, if you pick Ryan, and there's two Ryans, one's in the middle of nowhere, and one's in open ground compared to one playing natural cover. If the Ryan in the middle of nowhere gets his shield blown up, he really has nowhere to go and he's just going to have to take all that fire to his nose. But the Ryan close to cover has more options so he can go behind a wall and regenerate his shield and then come back out with the shield for his team another example would be a soldier v soldier battle a soldier on let's say high ground is gonna have a huge advantage over one that's on the low ground in the middle of nowhere he's gonna have to use his healing pad and resources try to sprint to cover instead of shooting back compared to a soldier on the high ground where he has a clear sight of the battlefield and shoot the soldier for free doesn't have to waste his healing field if he doesn't need to because all he needs to do is just back up and that is still natural cover so always thinking about things like high ground and natural cover is really important in determining godlike positioning because it gives you quite frankly more options to work with now the next thing moving on from using natural cover is taking space and to stop standing around and doing a whole lot of nothing let me give you an example let's say both teams have a ryan you're shooting a shield but you're not really doing anything you might as well just be standing still shooting at a shield nothing's really going to get done in the next like three or four minutes that you have to take the point so what can you do now as a dps player you might want to think about taking an off angle going around to the point where you have an angle to where you can shoot the ryan now the ryan has to think about do i shield the dude shooting me in the back but take all this damage from the front line or keep taking damage from you while your team keeps shooting the field most people would back up to the point where they can shield you and your team off from any damage which allows you and your team to take more control of the space that they are giving you now adding on to that let's say that space that you want to take the off angle on is being contested by a pocketed ash when taking or contesting high ground or space you need to take space with the plan put it quite simply you need to make sure that you have the resources to take that space and not just sprint in there expecting something to happen because then you're just going to end up dying which also is just bad positioning in order to take space with the plan you need to make sure that maybe you have an alt so you might as well just be alting the pocketed player or the healer and you can just alt the healer or the player being pocketed ask a support or if you have a winston to help dive the high ground with you so basically just make sure you have resources and having intention when trying to take space and win the fight now with that being said when you have this space the third thing that you need to remember is knowing when to give up space because at the end of the day dying is probably the worst thing that you can do when you're trying to carry a game 
what I mean by that. Say you're a soldier, you're holding this high ground, no one can contest you, and then all of a sudden they have a monkey Genji tracer that all jump you. Now, if you see them jumping towards you, you need to realize that they have invested like three resources or three players onto you to stop what you're doing. Holding that with a healing pad really isn't going to do that much against all three of those players, even with like a pocket mercy even. So being able to understand when to run or give up that space is very very important in terms of positioning being able to rotate to new positions of high ground and cover is and this kind of follows with the stop standing still because standing in the same position over and over again just gives your enemy more time to prepare for the same pattern that you've been showing the whole match so repositioning from one high ground to another will be more effective in your positioning and probably get you more wins more often I hope that made sense to y'all. If you think I missed anything or wanted to add on to anything, please comment down below. As always, if you learned something new or liked the video, please consider subscribing. It's free. It takes one second. And as always, take care of yourself. Take care of each other. Peace and love, baby.